Kenny Walkers, the Devin Longs, the Michael Johnson, Joe hit me talking, Korean Danes, the Sandra Blaine's, too many losses. Mixed up with that group, messed up Danny, so we're gonna miss y'all. You know what? Y'all gonna be crying like that white woman did when she shot that boy by accident. I didn't mean it, I'm gonna go to prison! <laughs> Say this though openly. I, I that that was a bad deal. It was wrong, and it, I, I'm definitely not justifying that boy's death. But I've been with y'all, man. That woman got a bad rap on this one, and that's just how bad. And white people and black people need to sit down and fix this foolishness because this the kind of shift that causes a problem in people who made an honest mistake. And yes, she shouldn't be a police. She shouldn't have a job because you're too dangerous for the end. But I really feel like that one that shouldn't have went to prison. I do. I don't know about the rest of y'all. That's everybody got on. I'll be honest with you. Because he made all the wrong moves, too, now. It wasn't like he was just standing there talking. You jumped in your car. What you getting? She did holler taser. She shouldn't have holler taser and just used the gun. And that, but then he been. I mean, really. Then what? Well, only thing hurt her is the fact she holler taser. I'm being under with you. Had she not holler taser, taser, that's what shot her in the foot. She would have got off on that. Cause they look. He jumped in the car. The car going. He could have hit the other officer. So now you got an officer who got to go home to his family who hurt, dead, or injured. She just the taser conversation shot her in the foot. But she was willing to understand and tell you. Yeah, she knows she done. She ain't trying to go, I know I didn't do it. I, she did it. And you can see, she, man, she, man, she blowed up too. Man, I, not, I know that got to be a just, just, it's hard find. And it's another case where, oh, man, it's just bad. It's bad. And we, they bad, he gone. And they bad. And I tell you, man, these folks get y'all, keep your damn hands off of stuff. Don't play around, folks. Everybody's scared for their life. Yeah. Don't be fidgeting around there grabbing nothing. These folks come to the car, don't these guys look at not part of your car, this be the last day. And some of them itching, then you got the one that's itching to shoot you anyway. Yeah. So every reason you not to fool around. And he should have known that. <sighs> fact she holler taser, let you know, I wasn't trying to kill him. I was gonna stun him. That's the fact she wanted to stun him instead of shoot him. You know the officer told you, I would have shot him. He was getting shot. You know the officer told you, he was shot, I ain't wasting no taser. You broke away. I don't saw you got a warrant for already for a gun. What I'm thinking, you don't have one now? Right, Your warrant they looking for you already say you done dealt with a firearm. What's the chance that you don't have one now? And I ain't finna find out you ain't. 
You jumped in this car for a reason, to grab something, to do something. So you had to respond that quick in order for you to be alive. Yep. That's, a, that's a really bad case. We lost on both ends. We lost a young man who should have known not to F around. And I tell you all that, don't play with these people. Then we got her. I really believe she made a mistake. I saw on the ground. Y'all saw that tape, man. Man, you know, that woman, she was, she was hysterical. She was blown away. She was looking at me. I wasn't trying to shoot him. I was really trying to stun him, just stop him. But, and then other police will tell you, man. If police, I know. One time he said, man, he said, I don't care no taser. I'm telling I know what, listen, flat, he told me, he told me, he said, man, he said, man, listen, I'm using these. He said, anybody want to hear some these and this? He said, man, I don't care no taser. He said, I'm going to tase you, and you're going to get this. He said, I don't need to time, so ain't going to be no mistake. Gun, gun, boom, boom, boom. <laughs> <laughs> right, but I don't know taser. But I've been with y'all, I really feel that was a bad, I know folks, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We got too many folks that ain't got, too many police officers that have wrongfully killed people, ain't got nothing. That's the part that's bad. We got people just deliberate deaths, just deliberate killings, and these bastards ain't went to jail. They celebrate one. Well, this lady really made a mistake, and she white. So her white skin is going to make her suffer more than what she should because of other people. It is bad. You know, you know what needs to happen? White and black need to sit down and fix this stuff. This is our foolishness. This is our foolishness, and we need to get it fixed. That's just being honest. We need to fix these problems. Listen, we ain't going nowhere. They're not finna exterminate all of us, and we ain't finna exterminate all of them. At some point, somebody use their head and say, when are we going to sit down and try to fix some of this junk? We ain't going to stop everybody. But it's enough of us that we can at least make an agreement on, I'll respect you and your rights. You respect me and mine. That's all we're asking for. There's nobody white to pick us up and carry us on their shoulder. Give me the respect as a man and a human being, and I'm going to do you the same way. You ain't got to like my color, ain't got to like yours. You ain't got to like my kid, ain't got like yours. Just don't mess with them. Same thing with yours. I won't mess with your kids, don't mess with mine. I ain't going to disrespect you, don't disrespect me, and the world will keep turning. But the way we got it right now, it's too many unanswered, too many questions, and we are naturally assuming the other one racist, the other one going to steal, the other one going to rape some, and the other one going to hang. So when you got all these bad vibes by each other, it's just made for bad encounters. That's why encounters are always bad, because we already, nobody willing to step up and say, listen, let's just give each other a fair chance. Give me a fair chance to be a man and prove myself. I'm going to give you a fair chance. Once you break that, then we're done. Y'all got it? Give people a fair chance now. I'm gonna mention again one more time.